Now to identify the appliance which is given in the image, what we see is that we, if we start from the posterior aspect, we see that the molars are banded. Okay, so we can see there are bands which are present on the molars. And there is a stainless steel wire which has been soldered onto the molar bands. Okay, and as we go anteriorly, we see that there are four artificial anterior crowns which are soldered onto the anterior aspect of this wire. Now this wire, although it appears like a Nance uh, palatal appliance or a space maintainer, it is actually not, in, uh, not touching the palatal aspect at all. There is no support which it is deriving from the anterior aspect. Okay, so this is not a posterior bilateral fixed functional space maintainer. What, is, what it is, is that it is replacing the anterior missing teeth. Okay, so the incisors are missing and this is an appliance which is replacing these uh, missing anterior teeth. So this is actually an anterior aesthetic fixed appliance, also known as the Groper appliance. So it's an anterior aesthetic fixed functional space maintainer. So it is functional because it's restoring the function of the uh, anterior teeth and maintaining the aesthetics of this patient. So such space maintainer questions are very important. And uh, since this is a very uh, atypical type of question, now the Groper appliance is not a very heard of appliance. So in this question, we have just been asked to identify it like an anterior aesthetic fixed appliance, right? But some of the more common uh, space maintainers, if they are given in the question, Usually what they will ask in the examinations is either their indications or their contraindications. So this is important to note in which situations they are used and in which situations they are contraindicated.